uh, just thought I'd do a little quick video here. Um, you can see I have a brand new, uh, completely stock SV06 Plus here. This is a full production machine. This is not my beta machine that I had previously. Um, and I just thought I'd do this because I know some of you guys uh, are having uh, issues, especially with the SV06, the original one, where um, you couldn't get a, a clean test pattern like this to print you know, across the entire bed. Um, but I basically just wanted to show you what I was getting with this machine. Here's a previous one. And you know, some would be perfectly fine, whereas others were way too far off. Or where's this one? Just a little, a hairs off, you know, um, and some just completely kind of aborted. And all I've done, I did basically one thing to this printer to go from this kind of mess to this. And we'll just pull this bed forward a touch so you can see to that. And all it was was I grabbed. Where is it? One of these, a trusty set square, and popped it up against the Z towers and made sure they were aligned, you know, and perfectly vertical. And this one was, but this one was not. So what that basically effectively did was twist twist the rods on the X because this this axis was skewed against this axis so this one would travel in a different direction and be at an angle just slight enough to throw it off and then that would mean the ABL system couldn't correct for the misalignment here uh, it just goes to show you, it's all connected, you know, one thing's off there and it throws everything off here. So you're looking here to try and fix something, whereas the actual problem's over here or wherever, you know what I mean? Um, so it just goes to show you how sensitive the setup of these machines actually is. Um, and it's completely transformed this test pattern. And like I said, all I did was undo the screws that hold this tower on and set it level with the the set square and same with that one with the rail that runs here the lower frame rail here um, against this so you make sure that angle is perfectly 90 on each side and then use um, you know a set of calipers or a measuring device uh, to have resting on the top and then have the probe down and measure both sides of this uh, the, the, the gantry here to make sure this is perfectly the same height on both sides you know you can do it from about where this line is you know like an inch in two and a half centimeters in um, and make sure that's square and like I said it went from that complete mess of a test pattern that the ABL system could not correct for um, to this which is basically perfect for all intents and purposes. There's a little bit off here and there because, you know, where the bed, you know, as most printer beds are, they're a bit kind of wobbly and wavy here and there, but the variance is so slight that the, the system can cope with it and correct for it now that the axes are aligned correctly. So yes, for anybody who is having this sort of issue where they can't get the ABL system to correct for any inconsistencies in the bed or they can't get um, you know a consistent test pattern across the entire bed like this I would recommend first of all popping off these four bolts here and the four bolts at the back these plastic covers and release the two bolts here and the two bolts here and then the two at the back on either side um, to square up the lower frame have the printer on 
a known flat and level surface like like this IKEA worktop thing I've got underneath here um, and then what that will do is it will square up the lower frame uh, so you know that's parallel and square and you tighten those all up you know kind of maybe do one bolt at a time each one and do it up slightly and slightly and slightly and slightly so they're all nice and tight you know guide diagonal even maybe um, and then what you want to do is get the set square put it up against the the frames and uh, you know after loosening the bolts there and there of course you know make sure they've they've slackened off and just make sure it's all square and you you go from the the mess that i showed you before where is it where is it these these horribleness to that just goes to show you what the setup can do